Hi guys, it's that time again. It's bike and eat time with Oliver and Michelle. Let me just pause so that we can admire the beauty of this tree, shall we? All right, so today's episode, we went to Rice Canyon. It's across the street from the park. And I'm just surprised that we've never even seen this spot. We live about 10 minutes away. We've driven by here. I mean, we've lived here, what, over maybe 20 years and we've never seen this place. And it's just the cutest thing. Check it out. This is exactly why we look forward to the weekends, why we love to ride. I mean, we get to be together outside, enjoying the sun, enjoying the fresh air, and just the quietness of it all. It's so peaceful. Here is my husband's attempt to tackle this hill. Now it may not seem that steep, but trust me, it is. Now I'm a type of rider and I'm quite aware of my abilities. Therefore, I'm also aware of my limits. And so I record from down below as I watch my husband um, press, press on. Uh, he is really strong. Uh, definitely he's gone further than I ever could and um, I'm proud of him. I know he stops right there, but I'm proud of him. That was a tough one. Like what I said earlier, this was a short but not too sweet of a ride, but we did it. Now, typically after our rides, um, Oliver would check our bikes, he would clean it up, and of course, I just go about and take videos and pictures of the surroundings. We'll definitely be coming back to this place. Not only is it only a few minutes from home, but I really enjoyed this ride. And so, we'll see you again. Yes, here comes the eat part. Of course, we go to my favorite place to shop, Trader Joe's. And of course, I have to grab the essentials, the chili and lime chips and corn puffs. Of course. And then I cannot forget 
coffee. Now, every time you see me shaking something like that, that means I'm screaming on the inside of excitement.、Um, well, yeah, because I don't think I can scream inside Trader Joe's, or maybe I can. I'll try next time. Welcome to La Cocina de las Mendozas. Today I was craving for some fried rice, so of course we need scrambled eggs, garlic, lots of it, and obviously you need rice to make fried rice. And since Trader Joe's do not carry spam, I had to settle for all natural, organic hot dogs. Now this here, the crushed garlic cubes, have been. A time saver for me, especially for those recipes that require a lot of garlic, like adobo. And in this case, we're making fried rice. Now you saw the green onions, so there's the green onions, scrambled eggs, and this here is one of my favorites. That's me screaming because I was shaking it.、Um, this is seaweed seasoning that I find. Adds a lot of flavor, so I put it on, you know, fried rice or even like ramen. It's absolutely delicious, and we also put pepperoncini. So you see me chopping them up, and I sprinkle them on top. Now, if we have jalapenos, I do the same thing: chop them up and sprinkle them on there. It's delicious. Now I just thought I'd do this. This is something that restaurants in the Philippines do, at least when I was growing up, that they would kind of just mold. They have the mold of the rice there, and it's me screaming of excitement for the rice reveal. Yay! <laughs>